Hey guys, welcome to the Trash Picture Show. Today I received in the mail the DC Collectibles Arrow Black Canary. This is from the CW series and this is the figure I got. These are the two other figures in that series. There's Oliver Queen and there's Malcolm Merlin. This is a long running CW series which I think is finishing up this year after the events of the Crisis on Infinite Earths, the CW kind of DC crossover and if I'm not mis mistaken, Oliver's daughter, Mia Queen, is going to be taking up the mantle. So I think the new series is going to be called Green Arrow and the Birds of Prey. And one of the main characters is actually going to be the Katie Cassidy Black Canary. So let's have a look at the figure. There was actually two Black Canaries in the series. The first one was actually Cathy Lotz. She played Sarah Lance. And she died and was resurrected and ended up joining if i'm not mistaken the legends of tomorrow her sister laurel ended up taking up the mantle and she kind of i think she she was in the season for about two or three seasons before she was killed off but she was brought back i think via the events of the crisis on infinite earths but her character was pretty cool very likable very kind of uh righteous uh, uh, and self kind of kind of self-confident in herself that she decided she wanted to partner up with Oliver and help clear Star City. Again, the CW shows, they're soap operas, essentially, with a, a superhero twist. They're fun, they're good, but they're, they're not They're not going to reinvent the wheel. They're not like, they're not Neil Gaiman or Grant Morrison level storytelling, but by God, they're still good and still enjoyable. So, um... I, I definitely recommend you check them out. So let's have a look at the figure. Figure is pretty cool. Uh, the face, it's, it's fairly close to, um, Katie Cassidy's kind of, uh, features. If you have seen the remake of, um, Black Christmas, she's actually the final girl in that. But yeah, they, they do a really good job kind of getting the detail on the face there. I'll just put it in close. Real nice detail on the mask. But I think where the figure really shines is the detail on her biker gear. In the comics and the other media, Black Canary's always been kind of a biker chick. And they made her armor to look like a, a, a motorcycle kind of outfit. And just really nice detail on, on the silver and black. Nice contrast on the belt. And just the little pouches and harnesses. And just even, even the, they didn't have to do this, but they put the zippers on the boots, on the on the really kind of sexy biker boots. They've really done a nice job. And yeah. Nice kind of flexibility there in the arms. Uh, the legs are double jointed. A bit gummy when I got it. So I had to kind of, I had to submerge her in warm water to, uh, to loosen out the joints. But again, really nice, really nice kind of uh, detail on the figure. Uh, she also comes with uh, this kind of nightstick. Uh, it kind of makes sense because her dad's a cop in the show so she kind of got this and there's a little there's a little holster for that there so you can you can pop it in like that or you can put it into her hand and she can hold it like this so she's ready to like kick ass she comes with uh two other sets of hands i kind of mixed it up because i wanted to have her in a battle stance but she comes with these open open hands she also comes with a as well as the left a right gripping hand and she comes with these two fists so she can box the shit out of someone but uh yeah really nice figure really cool figure uh nice articulation um Stands really well. Just by and large, really, really nice figure. And uh, if you're a collector of action figures, I do recommend the DC Collectibles because I got a Zatanna and the sculpting on it was fantastic. And again, they're, they're not NECA level, but they're certainly not the kind of cheap DC figures that you get for the kids. These are kind of their equivalent of the uh, Marvel Legends figures. And they're pretty damn good. And uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Black Canary. Very cool character. There's been many iterations of her before. The the most recent is in the Birds of Prey movie. With uh, Journey Smollett Bell. 
who plays uh, Dinah Lance in that. There's kind of a backstory to Dinah Lance. Originally, Dinah Lance was in another kind of universe in the DC, in the DC comics. She was in the Justice Society. So when they melded both universes together, Dinah Lance was killed and her daughters took over. And both Sarah and Laurel are kind of byproducts of that in the comic. So if you get a chance, definitely check out uh, Black Canary. Very cool character. Which is your favourite kind of version of Black Canary? There's been so many. Uh, did you like this, the Kitty Cassidy version? Did you like the Cathy Lotz, her sister, who uh, played by Cathy Lotz? Did you like the Maren Baccarin from uh, the Justice League Unlimited animated series? Who was your favourite um, Black Canary in any of the series or any of the mediums, be it cartoons or video games, in the Injustice games, who was your favourite? So, uh, yeah, my name is Martin. This has been a review of this really awesome figure. And uh, have a good one. Take care. Bye now.